So in this part, we get more of the cactus looking shape by sweeping a star instead of a circle along our curve. And let me show you how to make this star. So let me just open the project. Uh, what we have so far is a curve and a circle sweeping along that curve. To make that circle into a star, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna set position because I want to kind of modify it. And I'm going to modify this by taking the position and what is a star, it's like some parts of it are kind of squished inwards. So I'm gonna use a vector math operation. I'm going to scale it, if I can find scale, scale it inwards, but that kind of takes our, the entire circle and pinches it inwards. I wanna say only do that for every other point. So in the selection, what I can do is I can look at modulo two of the index. What this means is it's gonna see uh, which ones are divisible by two. So it's gonna go odd, even, odd, even, odd, even. So every other one, it's going to apply the scaling inwards. And this isn't it, because we can actually get a bit better. Uh, we can take this curve and fillet, or fillet it, don't know how to pronounce that, set this to poly and limit radius, and we wanna make sure the radius isn't too big, so something like this, add more points, and we can get just a bit smoother, like that, so that when we use our curve to mesh instead of a circle, we use the star, and this gives us the cactus-like shape. Uh, next thing I want to do is it kind of looks like a straight up thing. I want to kind of have a profile that looks like this. So it kind of gets bigger in the middle and pinches at the top. So let me show you how to do that.